everybody and welcome back to today's video. Today we are checking out a towing pack which includes three different types of tow trucks and roadside assistance vehicles. Uh, thank you to everybody who suggested I do a video on finding tow trucks and stuff. Um, I do apologize it take, took so long for me to get this out. It has been crazy. Please keep in mind that we have a bunch of videos coming out in the next week and a half which are some of our major videos which include longer tutorials, more in detailed things, stuff like that. New series, a bunch of stuff coming soon. So make sure to stay tuned for that because I can't wait to share it with all of you. Anyway, let's just go ahead and get started. So this pack goes ahead and brings you a tow truck, a roadside assistance vehicle, and one of these heavy tow truck things, which is actually pretty cool. I think it can become helpful in a lot of different servers. In order to download this, you're just going to click the download link, which is a Google Drive link. And inside of this download link, you can see there's three folders. So we're just going to copy all three folders, right click, and press download. It will then zip into a zip folder, which makes it very easy to install. Um, in the meantime, we'll go ahead and open up our resources folder. And inside of our resources, it come, it's from the server data resources folder in case you're new to installing cars and stuff. While we wait for this to download, what we're going to do is we're just going to wait here because this is the main folder where we're going to put all of our car files into. Um, in this case, they should come with the resource underscore resource underscore Lula thing or they should come with the stream folders uh, built in, which is very helpful. Some do not. Um, obviously, you can see one of the ones we installed last time does come with that. As long as you have this res underscore underscore resource dot Lula file inside of the file you're downloading, you should be good to go. So just keep that in mind. All right, so I have let the files download and we have them all downloaded here and you can see there are three different tow trucks here. What you're gonna do is you're just gonna drag these into your resources folder and inside of here you can see in each one there's a stream and data folder. This one doesn't have an underscore underscore resource dot Lula file so we're gonna actually have to add that. But you can see in the other ones you got the resource dot Lula file and you got the resource dot Lula file for your final one as well here. Inside of here you can see that it already has the data and the stream values inside of here so it sets up the handling files and everything so you don't actually have to worry about that at all. Um, but you can see in the one that doesn't have that it just has no uh, resource Lula file just these files. So what we actually have to do is we actually have to make the file for that. And to make it easier on ourselves I'm just going to go ahead and copy the one that we have in other places and I'm just going to paste it in here and we're going to edit this file with notepad or notepad plus uh, plus to make it a little bit easier. So in this case you can see that um, it's a little bit different. We don't have one of these files. So let's see what we have. We have this file it matches. Oh we don't have this one. Uh, so we have the vehicle uh, car variations file the vehicle file and we do actually have this one so we don't have a handling file so I'll go ahead and get rid of the handling part of this so we don't have to um, need that so we've gone ahead and did that and we don't also have a vehicle layout so we can go ahead and remove that as well um, so there we go we also don't have a vehicle names so we can just remove that as well there's no client script so now we just have our three files but since we've gone ahead and not added a path to these files we're actually going to move them from the data folder into the folder with the I resource underscore Lula and delete the data folder. This is something I like doing just to keep it a little bit more organized, but it's completely up to you on how you set this up. All right, so now that we have added our files into here, we actually have to add them to our server.cfg file. So we're going to go ahead and right click and press edit with notepad plus plus. And then I'm just going to put these files side by side so it's a little bit easier to see. We'll go into our resources file. So we're going to just ensure the folder names in this type. It's tow. Make sure your uh, caps lock is not on. Ensure tow truck is our first one and then ensure tow silv and then ensure tow wrecker um there we go save that and we can now go ahead and start our 5m server up uh, make sure you open the right 5m server and you can see there we go um it is sending errors regarding the physical memory of these vehicles um obviously it kind of depends uh, maybe this is new i've never seen that before and maybe it's actually because one sync's enabled um i don't know why i have one sync enabled but maybe it's because of that so i would go ahead and um just disable one sync and those errors would probably go away uh we'll go ahead and launch 5m and check out the vehicles all right, so I've gotten into game here, and I'm just going to go ahead and open up the trainer, go vehicle spawning, and then I'm going to go ahead and go all the way down to where spawning vehicle by a vehicle name. And our one of our vehicles was named Tow, so I go ahead and do that, and you can see it has really cool LED lights and everything, and we got our first tow truck here. Um, it's the same way to spawn the other vehicles, just to save a little bit of time, I'm not going to spawn those, but this is how you set this up. Uh, obviously, it is pretty cool, I recommend checking it out if you have the time. Obviously, tow trucks are a fundamental part of role-playing, especially when your uh, cars crash and you have like those types of things enabled. 
Um, so make sure to keep an eye on that and keep working on that. Anyway, um, hopefully this did help you understand how you can install tow trucks and everything else to your 5M server. Um, it's quite cool. Go check it out. Link is linked in the description below. Lots of cool videos coming soon. Every other day uploads. And I will see you in the next video, everyone. Goodbye.